Hello everybody, welcome to the sound test room and we are taking a look at a drum session. This is part three in a tutorial series covering, uh, it'll be shorter videos covering all aspects of drum session. So today we're going to look at tempo markers and how to change tempo in mid-track. So I have this little groove set up here over eight bars. Now, I would like to maybe slow it down here. So tapping anywhere on the timeline, even in the middle of a, a, a pattern, you can change the tempo. So it'll go from 163 down to whatever tempo you set. Now, this comes important procedures that you need to do. You open the tempo settings and insert a tempo change, okay? And then we can change our tempo down to 100, say, or any tempo you like. And then we can exit. And you will see if we go now from our beginning of our track, which will be at 163, once it reaches there, it will drop down to 100. Maybe we only wanted that 100 for one bar, you know, or whatever tempo you like. So you can set your your cursor here, your marker here, and you can set, insert another tempo change there. So important thing to do, first thing to do is insert the tempo marker, okay? And it will insert it at the previous tempo. And then we could speed it back up to so say 161. Actually, we could go 163, our original tempo, or even higher. We can exit that. And you will see now that we have successfully changed our tempo and our song. So the most important things to remember are when you first insert the tempo marker, it is insert tempo change there and then adjust the tempo. Otherwise, drum session won't know what you want to do with the tempo. OK, now you may think at some point you think, well, oh, do you know what? I wish I really wish I didn't I haven't put that 100 BPM there. It's easy to remove a, a, a tempo mark. You just touch on the tempo marker and it'll say drag here to remove tempo marker and then I need to do it like this. And then it's gone. So you are all at 163 again, even though there's a tempo change there, it's 163. But, you know, hey-ho, we can remove it anyway. doesn't matter. And that, guys, is how you change the tempo mid-track. Uh, I mean, for other, other good ways are, say, for instance, you inserted a be there so you'd have a uh, well maybe we could move it back a little bit there but you could have a gap there and then the tempo change sort of thing you know anyway that's various ways that you can arrange your uh you can arrange your different tempos and and, and, and patterns and things thank you for watching okay guys uh, yeah if you like the video give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel consider becoming a patron and i will see you guys later